This is AP News Minute. A wave of attacks across Baghdad and several Iraqi provinces has left dozens dead. Security forces apparently were the main target, but restaurants and a school also were attacked. A gun taken to a Washington State elementary school by a student went off, critically wounding an eight-year-old girl. Investigators are trying to determine how the boy got the gun and why he took it to school. A former University of Virginia lacrosse player is facing up to 26 years in prison after his conviction of second-degree murder and the slaying of his former girlfriend. The jury found George Hughley guilty in the death of Yardley Love. With White House fears that rising gasoline prices could undermine President Obama's re-election prospects, the president goes to Florida today to promote an energy strategy that the administration says will reduce dependence on foreign oil. John Belmont, Associated Press with the News Minute.